you know the story, obviously, maybe a little bit better than I do. So we're going to pull it up here. But you go ahead <laughs> and I? talk about what we're about to watch. All right. So let's well, let's watch it first, because I think I know what clip this is, but I'm not really too sure. I can't tell. Um, is Dreamer in there somewhere? I'm going to guess that it's going to be Dreamer's Dreamer. arm right there. Dreamer, the, because the, this is Beulah versus Francine. Yes. Yeah, so, so, OK, so so Shane obviously pro I'm thinking he took some kind of devastating move. And now Brian Lee's coming in to get Tommy. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. It's going to pick up as you get in the ring. So Okay. All right, here we go. So there we go. That's how we know the business is up. Yeah, I remember this. <laughs> oh, you give a smack to Tommy. Yeah, oh, okay. okay. So the, now, is the this, thing... Is this November to remember? Oh, that I couldn't tell you. This was okay. the arena. I know it's the arena. So I'm waiting for, for Beulah to come through. And there she wow. goes. Yeah. There she goes. Now, this cat fight was interesting because she had on these boots. I'm going to pause it as you can explain. Okay. So she, she had on these boots. Now, she's got a neck brace on, too. So, obviously, I think she took the um, belly to belly from Shane prior. Mm -hmm. And she's in a neck brace because, you know, she hurt her neck. Right. Um, the boots that she has on uh, the has hooks where the, la the, the ties go around, the uh, shoelaces. Right, my outfit is kind of fishnetty, right? And her uh, boots get caught onto my outfit. Oh, okay. So in order to get off me, she needed to rip uh. <laughs> where she ruined my outfit. Okay. Completely, completely destroyed my outfit. No, no fault to her. I never blamed her for it, but I was pissed because that outfit, not a lot of material, but it cost a lot of money. So. <laughs> Now, in her hands, she has a cookie sheet. She has a cookie sheet. Um, so now, not going to lie. It's a very thin cookie sheet. Yeah, I was going to say, cookie sheet sounds fantastic. They don't you... hurt. They don't hurt at all. Now, is that why, and as I hit the play button once again, the cookie sheet hits you in the head, and if you can tell, you pop right back up, Undertaker style. <laughs> and now, the, the infamous rolling begins. We got to go, man. The oh, show wait, wait, before the roll... Brian Lee's trying Brian to get Lee. on Beulah. Brian, Brian saved me because oh, that's okay. what we do in the triple threat. Oh, how about that? And Shane just put the boots to Tommy. Oh, yeah. how about that? A headbutt by Brian Lee. She was a bitch. She deserved it. How dare she come out? Now, Shane you is know? ripping off the neck brace. Now, again, um, that's why I'm going to pause because I, I, I do believe this could be November to remember 96 because it was Shane and uh, Brian Lee versus Tommy and Terry Funk. So it could Where's be Terry? Not seeing Terry Funk. So maybe it was the lead up to November to remember 96. So let's see. So now Shane's ripping the neck brace off of Beulah. Right. Yes. That, that can't spell good news for Beulah. That's no, she's, she's, uh, she's taking something here. So now Shane's another off. belly to belly. belly there we belly. go. Oh, uh, bye bye, sweetheart. See you later, Get her. Nice we to hate know. her. We hate her. Bam. Wow. I will say, I will say, she was my favorite girl to work with. Um, our cat fights were not vicious by any means. They were more so for the enjoyment of the men in the audience, I think. Um, but we always had a good time. I've said this so many times. We always had a good time working together and we never hurt each other. Yeah. Um, so she, she was a pleasure to work with, I have to say. Now, now who would you say took more physical abuse in ECW. Would you say it was you or would you say it was Beulah? I was there longer, so I, I'd have to say it was me. We know you took that belly to belly before. Right. And when you get hooked in that belly to belly. If you remember, that was a great um that was a great swerve. Um, and I'm going back. That was the only time I ever took the belly to belly from Shane. And it yeah. was it was when I was still working with Anthony. Right. And, um, you know, he comes, he, he comes out and I think he called me the ugliest bitch in ECW or something like that. <laughs> and I, I tell Anthony, you wait here and I go in and I smack him and, and then he gives me the belly to belly. But the whole time we were plotting against Anthony and Gary right. okay. and we were together. So, yes. so, so um, you got to take one for the team. Absolutely. I, I, and I did. And, you know, we, we actually loved each other, but I let him hurt me for the sake of swerving everybody. So, um, yeah, it was a good angle. And I don't think many people saw it until the night uh, of the four corners match. When yeah, I, re absolutely I, not. I remember the smart, marks in the front row going don't do it Francie just don't do it and I'm thinking 
How do they know? I didn't tell a soul. <laughs> like who stooched it off? You know? Probably Paul. Probably Paul. Don't... I don't know about that. It was only like five guys telling I don't me. Know, like those I would, guys. Those guys. They don't... knew everything. Yeah. And I would walk by, just don't do it, don't do it. I'm, and I would, what are, what are you talking about, though? Um, yeah, but it was, I loved working with Brian Lee. He was so fun. Yeah. So, so fun. Um, the bulldozer for hire. Yeah, he was great. Uh, you know, Chris Candido was great. And then so many uh, different incarnations of the triple threat. I loved Lance. You know, Lance Storm was great. Um, but I think my favorite was Bam Bam, Chris... Yeah. And Shane. And because uh, we uh, we were that was the longest group that that we worked with. Um, so and this but, is before this is before Chris even joined. This is just. Yeah. Ryan Lee and Shane and the tease was coming. Shane would flash the triple threat. But we didn't know who the third guy. Was right. Be. Right. Yeah. It was a uh, gosh. It was so much simpler then and and just better. <laughs> This Stuff is was my just favorite better. Era. This is my favorite era of ECW. Yeah. 1996 is my favorite ECW calendar year. Now, quickly, before we wrap this up, uh, sure. just a question about the wrestling attire. Was it cold? I know it got hot in the ECW arena, but did you feel a little, did you feel a little cold on the back <laughs> you, can, you, you can tell when I was cold, Chad. I won't leave it at that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just leave it at that. And we used to have to pause VHS tapes back in the day. But oh, we don't God. have to talk about that today. We don't no. have to talk about that today. That's a whole other topic. I have to go find my number one crush tape again.